Tomorrow, his wire shipping Fijian Rua will take on the Queensland Reds right here at the HFC Bank Stadium in Suva. And this is where it all begins, right here in the tunnels. Before the game starts, the team will assemble here before they run onto the field. Now, this is where the pressure builds. This is where the nerves can either make or break a team. Behind me, the stadium is empty right now. It's very quiet and there seems to be a calm in the air. But come tomorrow, this whole stadium will be filled with cheers and thunderous noise from the fans who will be cheering on. For the Fijian Rua, the cheers from the crowd will be an added motivation to get the job done. For the Queensland Reds, it will be a stark reminder that they are in foreign territory. The Fijian Rua have played five home games this season and have won four. They shot defending champions Crusaders 25-24 and edged Moana Pacifica 47-46 at Churchill Park in Lautoka. Both wins by a one-point margin. The Auckland Blues being the only team that was able to defeat them here at home, 30 points to 14. In Suva, the Melbourne Rebels fell to the Rua 38-28 and the Hurricanes were defeated 27-24. In order to qualify for the Shop and Save Super Rugby quarterfinals, the Ndrua have to beat the Reds. Earlier this year, Fijian Rua fans have been labeled the best fans in the world. And tomorrow, the Fijian Rua will be banking on you, the best fans in the world, to be here to support them. Whether you're here, uh, up in the grandstands or in the embankments, wherever you are, they will be banking on you to support them and power them through the 80 minutes. We caught up with some of the fans from last week's game against the Moana Pacifica, and this is what they had to say. The West fans are the best fans in the world. This is my mom's sister, Janelle, and my brother, oh, Xavier, Bernie, my cousin, and my sister, Darwin, and Julius and Michael. I think they've got really good skills and heart and spirit, so I always cheer for them. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>